that one. Oh my! Diddy! He might spoil me. All right, you guys, today we're gonna do some crappie fishing. I have a crappie max little swim jig right here with a one fourth ounce jig head. And we're just gonna be fishing down this bank. Really, this is kind of simple, the method I'm using. I'm just casting down diagonals of the bank. I'm just slowly reeling it in like this. It's nothing too crazy, guys. Real slowly down this bank right here. Oh, there's one right there. I think that might be a bass or a crappie. No, a, what is it? It's a crappie. There we go, guys. Just like that. Just cast diagonal down the bank with this jig and reel it super slow. He busted the bottom super fast or busted that bait super fast it's a nice little crappie i don't really fish for crappie a lot guys but they're awesome once you find out where they're at in the schools you know let me get this in view for you guys i want you to see it all right that's what he ate guys that little crappie jig it's awesome hey, i'm gonna let him go oh, see you buddy it's not really rocket science guys you just find somewhere somewhere with a little bit of depth and some rocky a rocky area and you fish at an angle you guys can see at an angle at the bank so as i showed you right there cast at an angle and i'm just working it back down the bank and i'm just waiting for a strike i'm not doing it super fast Drilling in super slow. These crappie will sit on these rocks and wait for minnows and any type of small fish to come by where they can just snatch it. Especially this time of year when everything's spawning. This is really time for them to fatten up because the crappie are about done spawning. There's another one that missed him right there. Right there at the bank. Thumped it. Oh, what is that? I mean, he hit it as soon as it hit the water. Oh, it was a bass. Well, guys, a little minnow will do a lot for you. Get your bass, crappie. It's definitely working on bass today. There's one. Another bass. The little guy they love these minnows just as much as crappie do I, i'm telling you not the species we're targeting but never an unwelcome sight I'll tell you that look at that guys a little bass right there for you see you buddy get big be a 10 pounder for me one day see um when I throw it out there, I let it sink. So when I reel it in, it's right on the bottom of the rocks. That's why I reel it in really slow. Now you can get hung up doing this really, really easily, but you gotta you gotta be able to fin finesse it over rocks, sticks, stuff like that. And you know, if you lose a couple lur lures, it happens. You know, so what you gotta do? So what I do to catch them, at least. All right, guys, that color's not doing tremendously well. Um, I'm actually going to tie on a double rig right here and see how this works. See right here, guys, I poked it through the head. I'm moving it all the way down till I get to the very tip of the tail. And I'm squishing it up on that head jig, and there you go. Just like that. Now let me tie on a double rig right here. I want to see if that will 
improve my chances a little bit. So all I'm going to do is figure out how far I want it from the bottom to the top right here. Which I want it right here. Loop it through that hole right there. You see what I'm doing? Figure out the length I want it. I want it about a foot away from my bottom line. So that's, that's about where I want it, right there. You guys can see, and I'm gonna take it. This line, I loop through it. I'm gonna wrap it around both the lines on the other end, right? And I'm gonna grab it right here. Now I'm gonna take this, dump it through that line again, and him. Fold it all over and tighten it all up. And right there, we have a double rig, my friends. We got this one with a little red head on it, and this one with a little black jig head. And that's what we're going to be using. There's that double rig going in. Already got something. Look at that. Look at that. Just cast it in. Just cast it in with that double rig. I mean, first cast with the double rig. Just cast that in. And I was just seeing how it looked in the water, too. I wasn't even trying to catch a fish. It's about the same size we've been catching. I put on the double rig. I want to give myself a little bit of a better chance at hooking up with these fish. Kind of get a mimic of a school, schooling shad kind of what I want to do oh there's something there's something right there oh <laughs> well there is something I think that's my PB stick right there oh what a monster look at that guys bet you haven't caught nothing like that get out of the way dang stick can't even catch fish around here uh, getting hooked into a stick. Got one. Oh my! I think this is a bass. He might spool me. I think this is a bass, guys. I could be wrong. I gotta chase this damn thing down the bank. He about broke me off. That is a bass. Diddy! Oh my gosh, guys. This is probably about a three, four pound bass. Oh, he's not hooked good either. Oh my goodness. Uh-uh, uh-uh, this is where it gets sketchy. This is where it gets really sketchy. It's where it gets sketchy. Right here. Start farting around with him. I got him. Oh my God. Look at that, guys. Did I m mention that you can catch bass like this? All right, guys, did I need to mention that crappie fishing um, can land you 
large bass. If I can get this out. He's, he's not that big. He's not that big, but uh, yeah, he, he's pretty, he's pretty big. All right, get a little weight on him. Make your guesses right now, Denny. Three pounds and Is this even three on? ounces. You gotta like hold it. There you go. I'm going to say, I'm going to say three pounds. 10 ounces, almost a four pounder. That's a nice one. All right, guys. Three pounds, 10 ounces. Caught him on a little minnow trying to catch some crappie. Oh, let's get this big, big guy back in the water. Let him breathe a little bit. Whenever you're ready, buddy, you can leave. You ready? Woo! It scared me. <laughs> All right, let's, let's try to get some crappie. These little baits right here, especially these double rigs, especially with lakes and rivers and any type of water system, with minnows, small, small, small fish like this, these are really good, these double rigs. I mean, you catch anything from a four-inch crop crappie all the way up to 10 pound bass I got another one my first cast look at that crappie I just caught a three pound bass and turn around catch a nice crappie like I was saying guys <laughs> these little double rigs right here the you can't beat them I mean you can catch anything on these but primarily what we're targeting is crappie. And that's what we got right there. That's a nice crappie. That's what we're doing. First cast, literally first cast with the double rig after that three pounder. Let me let this guy go. See you, buddy. There you go. I want you guys kind of get a look at this. See how it moves in the water? It's like a school of minnows. You can't really see that bottom one, but I'm gonna show the bottom one too. It's like a school of minnows right there. And that's what we're trying to mimic. And these fish, they feed them, they feed on them regularly. So that's that's what they're gonna be feeding on. So we're gonna mimic that. Just reel it down these banks where they will be feeding on these minnows. And just wait. The key to this, like I said, is just working these banks, letting it sink to the bottom, working the banks. And that's really the key to it. But I'm, I'm gonna shut up and I'll let you guys enjoy the video. There's another one. That's a little bigger. I think that's a bass. Is that a carp? No, that can't be no carp. That's the channel. Well, I said it will catch any fish in the river system that's feeding on these minnows, right? I mean, I, I've caught a crappie. I've caught a three pound bass. Now I got a channel and he hit the bottom one. Dang channel. What the heck, man? Come here, buddy. Oh, stinker. Come on, man. When I'm not trying to catch channel catfish, I catch them. Right on that minnow. I'm telling you, these crappie max minnows are spectacular. Caught some crappie. Caught a three-pound bass. Caught a nice channel. Right there. Thank you, buddy, for the fight. As I was saying earlier, these minnows, they'll attract anything, catch anything on them. First, I thought that was a carp. See you, buddy. I've only been here an hour and I've had a whole day of fishing already. I got Denny fishing these jigs now. He was bass fishing and he saw me catch that three pounder. And Well, he put on a jig. It's like that meme I made. When your buddy finally listens to you and starts catching fish, right? Oh, there's another one. 
Oh. I think this is a bass, guys. Denny's got one too. He's got a crappie. Oh, this is a crappie too. Look at that. That's a big one. That's a big crappie right there. That's a slab, guys. My goodness. He choked that thing. All right, guys, there we go. That's a dinner size crappie right there. Nice size crappie. This is what we're trying to catch. Denny just hooked up with a with a black crappie too. That's a good sign. That means we're we're in the area where they're at. So I'll let this guy back go. There he goes. Got something. Nice crappie. Look at that, guys. Another nice crappie right there. See you, buddy. There's one. There's another crappie. Oh, he got off. Right there. He's right under that rock. Their bites are so subtle, it's hard to tell when you actually got one. There's one. Another black crappie. I believe it's a black crappie. On that top minnow right there. That is a nice crappie right there. I'm gonna let him go. Let's see, you, buddy. Been killing him today, didn't he? Poor guy, he hasn't even had near the luck I've had. I've caught about everything in this lake. About to pack it up. I wanna go catfishing later, so I ain't really got the time to be farting around with these crappie that long. All right, one more cast, guys, and we're heading out here. getting kind of sunburnt oh last cast a little crappie look at that all right guys i think this is going to be the video for today i'm going to end it on a good note with a uh, small crappie about six inches i'm going to end it on a good note this right here this double rig with the the uh, crop and max with the jig head, that's that's the way to go. See you, little buddy. Thank you for the last cast catch. All right, let's head out. Oh. What up, you guys? It's Randall. I hope you enjoyed that video. If you did, leave me a like and a comment down below and subscribe to me. And if you want to see more quick hint release, you can go to Instagram or you can go to TikTok. Either one. You'll see all the latest stuff I'll post before it even touches YouTube. And if you like any of the products I use in this video, I'll leave them all down in the link description below. So if you want the Crappie Max, I'm going to leave it down in the link description below. And I'm going to leave alternatives to the Crappie Max in Amazon. That's cheaper and you get more quantity. When you purchase from Amazon, it supports me and it supports the channel. So you guys can purchase whatever you want. I'm just letting you no, I really hope you guys enjoy this content. I enjoy making it. It's really fun. As always, guys, peace, love, God bless. It's <laughs>